Hi everybody, it's Lavinia and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be opening up this box. It should contain my pan pastels and some soft tools. I've never used pan pastels before, but there's someone that I follow on YouTube and I and on Patreon and she uses pan pastels. So they were on sale and I ordered it and just want to see what they look like. I'm not going, going to swatch them, but this is just an unboxing to take a look. Okay, so these are, this looks like this. The soft tools, it says 44 tool set paint draw blend. And there's different types of applicators and handles. So I guess this might be better to look at it this way. So they call these, I guess, knives and covers. So there's round, flat, oval, pointed, and sponges. So wedge. Point looks like a and is that a hexagon, a round, a flat, a different type of round. So these look more slanted. And then here's the applicators. So looking forward to oops to using these. And then here is the the box with the pastels. So I want to open these up and look at, take a look at them. Um, everyone says that they're really great, but sometimes, depending on how they're packaged, they they may be crumbled. So I want to make sure. I mean, so far this one looks like it's been packaged nice, and the box itself, the Amazon box, was not damaged in any way. And I don't know why my color looks odd, because this looks like it's. A red like a real apple red but I don't know on my video at least in the camera it looks like it's coming up orange but there's it says here 20 uh, painting I guess discs and it also has some tools in here too so these are the colors all right so let's go ahead and open this up and take a look All right, I'll be right back. I was trying not to damage the sleeve, but it looks like that's pretty much what I have to do. So here's, I guess, one sponge. This does look like it's crumpled. And some tools. Yeah, so this one looks like it's crumpled already, so, okay, and there, there's another sponge. So it looks like there's other tools at the bottom of them, but let's, let me take a look here. Maybe, just in case there's powder. Okay, so that's the sponge. So here's a gray, there's white, that looks like it's black. This looks like a greenish, like a greenish gray. I'm sure there's the name of it on here, probably actually. That looks like it would be chromium oxide green. So there's titanium white, black, and neutral gray and this one looks like it's either going to be red iron oxide or burnt sienna but that's too bad that just want to open it up here it's all crumpled well i guess if i use it i would just have to be careful with the tool but i would think that it's usable Okay, 
Okay, so I'm just gonna, and I think you can buy a tray where you can fit these discs all in rather than keeping them like this. All right, so that's that one. So this one has some more tools here. Ooh, that's a pretty blue. That looks like it's phthalo blue. This one is violet. This one is magenta. So these look like they're the brights in this column or this stack. This one, this one looks like someone put their finger in it, but this look, so this looks like it would be the red iron oxide and this would be the burnt sienna. And this one is permanent red. It's a very bright red. Right. And then here we have some more tools and applicators. So pretty much these like look like makeup sponges. And here we have, this is a very bright green. I am thinking this might be permanent green. This is turquoise pretty. This is phthalo blue. It's either phthalo blue or ultramarine blue. Ah, it's phthalo blue. So they have their names at the bottom. Okay. Well, that's good. And this one is phthalo green. We'll close those later and then here's the last so these are the round tip applicators this is bright yellow green the next one is going to be Hansa yellow it's very pretty This next one is Dairy Lid Yellow. Diary Lid Yellow? Don't know, I've never heard of that in any color, any um, color medium. But this one is Yellow Oxide. And this one is orange. So that's it there. So it looks like the only one that was crumpled was this one here, the burnt sienna. But again, I'll see if I can use it. And, it, and people do say that a little goes a long way. And once I start testing them out, I will do a video on that. I've seen quite a few tutorials that use the pan pastels along with either markers or color pencils. Um, I think you can use watercolor, fine liners, other pastel like the chalk pastel or the oil pastel. So looking forward to using these. And once I have a video up, I will go ahead and maybe do a tutorial, like a small little tutorial. And I hope you like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Take care. Bye.